The longest and deepest rail tunnel in the world is being officially opened in Switzerland. It's taken 20 years to build, cost more than $12 billion, and is set to transform train travel in the heart of Europe. Here's our technology editor, Tarek Basley, with more. Here's the Levantina Valley in the south of Switzerland, near the Italian border. And here to the north, you can see parts of the Swiss Alps, with peaks as high as 3,200 metres. For centuries, these mountains have been a major transport barrier for anyone wanting to travel or move freight into the rest of Switzerland, to the country's main cities, and on to northern and western Europe. But now, after decades of planning and construction, the Gothard Base Tunnel is finally finished. The twin rail tunnels run 57 kilometers beneath the Alps. This makes it the longest rail tunnel in the world, beating both Japan's Saikan Tunnel and the Channel Tunnel between England and France in terms of length. It's also the deepest. It pretty much stays at the level of the valley, which means at points it has 2,300 meters of rock above it. The tunnel will be able to take 260 freight trains a day, much bigger and heavier ones. This will take the pressure off the roads and reduce the number of trucks carrying freight through the mountains. About 65 passenger trains will also use the tunnels each day. They'll be able to travel through it at up to 250 kilometres an hour, cutting an hour off some routes. But hold off buying your tickets. More than 3,000 test drives through the tunnel are scheduled to be carried out before it's open for service in December this year.